Holly Berry has to pay that man $16,000 a month. $16,000 a month. Holly Berry is paying a privileged white man $16,000 a month. It seems to me that black men want to desegregate everything, including the black family. I said, it seems to me black men want to. I got a cat that'd be around FDMG. Brothers, keep a cat in your house. You got to keep a cat in your house because the cat will let you know if a woman got a good heart or not. I love cats because if a woman don't got a good spirit, the cat won't go nowhere near that woman. If your cat don't go over to your woman and try to hug up and snuggle up under your woman, that woman got a bad spirit. I always use cats because cats can see spirit. The original ancestors of the cat cat spirit they come from ancient Kemet cats originated in the Nile Valley Africa I don't know if y'all know that cats originated in the Nile Valley of Africa cats are very spiritual they can see aura they can see spirit so I love cats anytime you date a new queen you better have you a nice cat I like black cats personally I'm gonna have a black cat in my FDMG office I'm gonna have a black cat in my FDMG office and whenever you have a new female friend, bring them around the cat. Bring them around the cat. And if your cat don't like that woman, you might want to think twice about being with that woman. I said, if your cat don't like that woman, you might want to think twice about being around that woman. Stop begging start building the only thing black men want to desegregate is the family they want to desegregate everything including the family see a black man in a snow bunny is a desegregated black family a black man in a snow bunny is a desegregated black family a black woman in a snow puppy is a desegregate you have integrated the black family why did we need to integrate the black family why did we need to integrate the black family? Wasn't the black family doing fine all by itself? Wasn't the black family doing fine all by itself? Wasn't the black family doing fine all by itself? And if the black family was doing fine all by itself, why did we desegregate the black family? Can somebody explain to me why black men decided to desegregate the black family, swap out black women, for white women why did the black woman decide to desegregate the black family swap out the black man for the white man why why did we desegregate the black family i'm putting together a petition for the supreme court to overturn loving versus virginia 1967 i'm putting together a petition for the united states supreme court to overturn its 1967 Loving versus Virginia decision that outlawed all bans on interracial marriage. I want the Supreme Court to reconsider their decision in Loving versus Virginia. I want it, I want it overturned. I want it to be illegal again. I want it to be illegal again for black men to marry Snow Bunny because the Snow Bunny crisis is destroying the black community. The Snow Bunny crisis is destroying the black community. For my brothers, give me a fist. For my queens, give me a heart. Who will sign the petition to overturn? Who will sign the petition to overturn Snow Bunny rights? Ladies, give me a heart. Ladies, give me a heart. I want to know right now. Ladies, give me a heart if you will sign the petition to overturn Snow Bunny privilege. Brothers, give me a fist. I'm not, we're going to put a petition. I want the Supreme Court. I'm going to write to Jer Clarence Thomas. I'm going to ask Clarence Thomas, can the Supreme Court please 
revisit the 1967 interracial marriage loving versus virginia law that outlawed all bans on interracial marriage it is destroying the black community black men are so full of self-hate they want to marry anything that don't look like them. I said black men are so full of self-hate. They want to marry anything that don't look like them. I said black men are so full of self-hate. They want to marry anything that don't look like them. I want it overturned. Our kids ain't got black mothers. They ain't got black fathers. They ain't got black role models. The money in the black community. Let's look at Holly Berry. Mixed race African, but still an African nonetheless. Let's look at Holly Berry. Mixed race African, but still an African nonetheless. Let's look at Holly Berry. Mixed race African, but still an African nonetheless. Holly Berry lost her custody battle to her white ex-husband. Holly Berry lost her custody battle to her baby daddy, her white baby daddy. And now she lost the child support battle. Holly Berry has to pay that man $16,000 a month. $16,000 a month. Holly Berry is paying a privileged white man $16,000 a month. Holly Berry is paying a privileged white man $16,000 a month. Holly Berry is paying a privileged white man $16,000 a month. The snow bunny crisis is a military strategy by the white power structure where they send white women in as undercover agents, financial assassins, and they send the white woman into the rich black man's house as a financial assassin. And her job is to liquidate all of his assets Back to the white power structure. I'm going to say it again. The white woman is a military espionage agent of the white power structure. Her job is to infiltrate the homes of all wealthy and rich black men and liquidate their assets back to the black community. I'm telling you, the snow bunny crisis is a military campaign. I'm telling you, the snow bunny crisis is a military campaign. I'm telling you, the white woman is on assignment from the white power structure to destroy the economic power of the black community. Just like they desegregated the black dollar, in the community, now they're going to desegregate the black man's bank account. I said the white woman's job is to desegregate the black man's bank account. I said the white woman's job is to desegregate the black man's bank account. I said the white woman's job is to desegregate the black man's bank account. I don't hate no white folks. I respect all people. I got white fans. I got hundreds of thousands of white fans. They come up to me in the airport. They sit down for a conversation. They email me. They inbox me. They take pictures with me. I have white fans. I don't hate. I got Chinese fans. I got Arab fans. I got Mexican fans. I got Native American fans. I don't hate nobody. I'm the most popular non-celebrity in the black community.